have cheated on him. Yeah, but obviously, bro, obviously there's a lot of male su- suicide and stuff, and, that, and I f- apparently that's one of the, the reasons for I'm it. I'm telling as well. you, bro, women are way more stronger mentally than us. Mm. Way, they can cope with way more than us. Mm, mm, mm. Bro, us. Bro, if a man gets cheated on, is We've got bro, the, he's men, changing, men have got the highest suicide rates. Bro, mm. if a man gets cheated on, he's a changed man. But I, listen, I. I like I was gonna go into this kind of topic afterwards, but I, thought, I guess we can deep deep into it in in, in a sense. Like, so like if you want to do an intro first, though. Okay, we'll do an intro. We're already deep. Actually, we're already seventeen deep. minutes deep. What? That's for two days. That's for two days. How much meat did you take? Bro, look, the, the, the meat that I had. What meat? Oh, that's the meat from before. Yeah, yeah from the before. Sauce, okay, okay. There's a lot of sauce there. There's a lot of there's sauce, sauce. There's a lot of sauce. There's a lot of sauce there. I haven't even eaten, bruv. No, but there's a lot of sauce. Have I eaten? <laughs> Is there a lot of stew left, though? Check, check, check. Have I eaten? If there's not, if there's not take out some. Have I even eaten? Huh? Has your elder even eaten? Hey, your elder, elder. You don't eat meat, though. That's, no, no, no. Stew, bro. The meat, oh, the meat okay. is from before. Okay, okay. It's and I'm, I'm getting closer and I'm thinking about it a lot. It's good, it's good, yeah, it's good, it's good. It's good, it's good. I'm thinking about this it. This guy, it's it's good, good, good. Him. he overreacts, you know. It's good, he's seen lost. Johnny, you got any water? Yeah. Can I get some, please? Bottle of water, please. Alright. Uh, anywho, welcome to episode St. Tros. Sorry, sorry. Welcome to episode St. Tres Tros of the Shoot and Shoot podcast. Uh, let's, uh, Johnny, I'm gonna, I'm, wait, hold on, hold on. Johnny, I'm going to give you first guess. Go on. <laughs> it's the language you know very well. That's not French, the yeah, way you know you said. That's not French. Should I do in a French accent? <coughs> Bro, I, I, I'm i not even going to lie to you. I had no idea. Vazon, Vazon, is it? PSG, PSG. 133. 133. 133. 133. 133. Fucking hell, bro. Cheers, bro. Just stop. 133. 133. Since Charles Trois. Fucking hell, bro. <laughs> Let me just do the intro. <laughs> Welcome to the episode 133. Jeez, that's, that's really good, actually. Bro. He's really French anyway, man. Fuck off, man. <laughs> oh, this shit, butcher, shit. You butcher punch. every language you speak, even English. <laughs> <laughs> bro, even English, bro. English. <laughs> Fucking hell. I was never good at English at school. I was more of a math guy. What did you get in English? I got a C. I, I scraped through school, bro. C C C C C C C. Man said that sailor went to C C C to see where he can see. That's it, bro. Speaking of Babavoom, the goat himself. Jeez, man, like Thierry, man of the match, Hall of Fame, Hall of Fame. So I was gonna go to the topic, yeah, because like, like this week, yeah, I've been kind of like stressed in it, like just generally over shit, and like because it's been like building up loads of different shit, yeah, like especially today, it just hit me in all one going in, and I was just. I lost all motivation for like bare shit. Yeah. Like for bare shit. I was just like, I couldn't even be over to do the podcast today. I was almost like, you know what? I can't be able to fucking do this podcast anymore. Yeah. That's how much it hit me in it. But then like, and then I was thinking I need to speak about it because it's pissing me off. Like this lack of motivation I had. Cause it's, it's not, it's not normal for me to have this lack of motivation mm. in me. I'm kind of over it now. Right. I'm kind of over it now. Like, Maybe I just need that downer to level me out. Yeah. To like that to, to help me get back to this point. Like you need to have your 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 roller coasters. Do you mm. know what I'm saying? But I was kinda of thinking about like at that moment in today I was like when I was fucking just like, nah, this is all long. I was like, how do the man them in general just like a get out of slumps and just motivate themselves? Cause like, it depends how deep the slump is, bro. Cause I knew it wasn't a deep slump. I knew it wasn't like depression in it. Mm. It wasn't that. Cause like depression is when it's for like a long period of time. Mm-hmm. And this has been like one day and like one month, and I'm like, oh, it's just been a bad week and whatnot, yeah. But then I was kind of like, wait, so this isn't that big a problem for me, cause like sure. I said, so it's a short thing. So I was like, how do how do people deal with that? Constantly, do you know? It, do you know what it is for men, yeah. Gone. It's like we let it build up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You get mm. as a man, you don't want to always share how you feel, mm. how you feel. Mm. You get. Yeah, yeah. So it just builds up for us. Sometimes we we feel like we want to talk, mm. but you can't because mm. you feel like, oh, it's gonna. How can I say this? 
it's gonna um we don't like to inconvenience yeah. other people still bro we don't we don't bro we don't mm. unless you have a wife mm. sometimes you don't even share it with your wife yeah yeah, yeah. Do you get mm. as man i feel like we need to share our feelings more but who do you guys share your feelings with I like don't. who do you? that's the thing i don't Same that's my it. problem that's my biggest problem mm. like for me i'd rather deal with things by myself mm. than talk to other people yeah, but that's how i grew up mm. do you get bro if I have a if I have a problem, I rather deal with it by myself mm. than talk to other people about it. Because I don't, I feel like I don't, I, I don't have the feeling to to talk to other people about it. That's mm. my problem. Mm. I have to deal with it by myself. Mm. Do you get? Mm. It feels like um, I'm putting my problem on someone else's shoulders. 100. That's for me. Mm. Yeah, mm. but the other person might not even see it like that. Mm. But that's how I feel personally. That's for me. I get that because like. Oh, like my, my me and my sister are really close in it. Like every day, my sister will come and tell me her problems. Mm. Like she has any problem, she'll tell me this will happen at school. It's causing me a problem. But she'll let it out, right? That's a but strength about a woman. That's a strength. But I clock. I do not do that. Bro, we at that's, all, bro. You're not the only one. There's bare man or do you, bro? Hey, it's I just can, men in general. We don't. Just, yeah, yeah, just men in general. Bro, I can go through it a lot, mm. but then. You, I'll still be the same me mm. in front of people. Mm. That's why they get, say you need to check on your check on your friends. Yeah, even, bro. Even can, the ones that seem the strongest, the strongest or the ones that smile or or laugh the most, you need to check on them. Check, bro. There's so many. There's so many guys here bef- um, that have committed suicide. Yeah, but yeah. before they used to be bubbly, jokey. Look at Gary like, Gary Speed, bro. Mm. Bolton player. Like he was on TV. I swear he was on TV just a couple. Yeah, couple nights before. Couple he took nights his before life. he took his life, bro. Like and it looked like ev- everything was going well good. for him. He was, he, what, what, what was he? Was he something in Wales or something? He was, well, was manager from what I remember. Or he was, he had a role in Wales. Like everything was looking, yeah. life was looking great. Then all, great, of sudden, all of a sudden, breaking just, news, Sky, yeah. this guy's committed suicide. Couldn't mm. even believe it. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, like that's, that's, that's just weakness for, for us, man. Because mm. we don't want to share anything. Mm. We want to go through it on the ones. Mm. That's our weak. That's, oh, our that's big, poor. That's, that's a clanger. From keeper, isn't Fucking it? Fucking hell. That's our biggest weakness. What are you doing, bruv? Sleeping on the job. Our biggest weakness. Because mm. mm. we don't want to share. We want to go through it. But my, oh no. That's for me anyways, bro. If I have a problem, you'll never... No, no. Mm. No one will ever know I have a problem. Speaking of getting out of it, though, I feel like sometimes you just get like a random word of inspiration. Like I'll shout out Kudzi, innit? Like, when I was... um, When I was getting really fat at one point <laughs> and I was like the heaviest I'd ever been like during this lockdown period, innit? Yeah. And then we did the podcast like a few, was it a few weeks ago? Um, The last one we did at your, your crib. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Kudzi said like, oh, like I'd hate to be that guy that like comes that out of lockdown, you, comes out of lockdown and everyone's looking like, rah, he f- lockdown finished him. Yeah, that got to you. And that, got that got to me, bro. Like yeah. you can tell, you can tell on it. Like, That's I've the been, thing. I've been in, like, I've, been, I've been playing ball. Like, I don't know. It just, that little word there just stuck with me in it. And it just like, okay, cool. Like, nah, nah, I need, I need to get my shit together. So I started getting active, started fasting. I've lost, I've lost a bit of weight now. Still, you know, trying to trying to lose a bit more in that. But it's like, yeah, okay. That's that's the whole that's the whole reason. Mm. Do, you, do you know? Because we spoke in it, I guess. Yeah. yeah. And the maddest thing is, yeah, no man will go to the man and say and tell the man them how they feel. Would you? Nah, not 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 just out of the blue. It have it have to be a, maybe we're having a conversation. And oh, that, or and a then close I'll, close man that you've yeah. known for for years. No man them will go up to to another. All right, cool. Let's say, let's just say the man them are here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and you have a problem that's affecting you. Mm. You'll not go to the man them and tell them, would you? No, not me. Like not, not today. You. I didn't. I didn't tell anyone. That's what I'm saying. You'll not go to the man them and tell them. I didn't tell anyone. Would you go to the man them and tell them? I didn't that's tell the difference anyone, between no. girls. Girls could be there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They Even if about, they they t- they, they, they talk overshare. About, they they that's overshare. Yeah, they yeah, overshare, yeah. but mm. that's good for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They talk about everything. Okay. I would not wake up one day. Two clangers, bruv. Oh my god. Bro, I would not wake up one day and go to the man and tell, and tell the man how I feel. Yeah. Right. Some of them would take it as a joke. Okay. So, like, I was I was just thinking that, like, in regards to, like, maybe this just works work for us, right? Like, Jay was saying he heard those words from Kuds and boom. Is tough love a way Wait. to yeah. get people out of depression or yeah. to get 100%. people out of these things? So, no, but it depends on how the person is. For me... How they're built, yeah. Yeah, for me, bro, tough love, bro. Yeah, I, yeah. That's how I've been brought up. Yeah, yeah. So, we, if, you t- if, you tell him, if you're telling me, um, I want I want a challenge yeah, to come yeah. out of my, my slum. Yeah, yeah. Do you get? 
like I don't want the easy way out. Yeah, yeah. That's not how I've been brought up. I've been brought up with the challenges and that. Mm. So I want a challenge to get out of my slump. Yeah. So a tough love is like, it's the right thing for me. Yeah. Personally. It might not be the right thing for certain people because certain people are more um how can I say this? They're more soft. weaker. Soft. Yeah, soft. Yeah, some people mm. are soft. You mm. can't you can't not everyone would take um the hard the hard bit of the process. Yeah, yeah. If you know what I mean. Yeah. Not everyone would take um cri- I like criticism. Yeah, yeah. That's how I built. Not everyone's good with criticism. Do you know what? I, I, I'm with you. I, I, I like criticism. Like, I much rather someone tell me I am shit at something. Yeah, so I can work harder. So I can be like, okay, what can I do to improve? Rather than say, yeah, that's good. Like, boom, boom, boom. I'd when rather you, you tell you know me, shit. I'd rather you tell me, like, like when I play football, just for perfect example, when I play football, yeah, I I I don't mind you telling me to fuck off or shit mm, or whatever. Mm, mm. Say do better because I know I can do better and I know I should do better. But like, is that how you solve everybody's problems? No. Like, because 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 I'm I'm just trying to think. I'm just trying to think like because I didn't have anyone give me any any tough love today. Kind of thing. I kind of had to push myself to tough love myself. Mm. If that makes sense. Like Sometimes just work like hard or just whatever. Or listen to Naruto, boom, or whatever. So I'm just thinking like in a general kind of span, and I know it's wrong to obviously put depression and like self-motivation in a general sphere of sphere of things, but can that help push the majority of like, people? You see, no, nah, not for everyone. Like for me, when I'm the football thing, yeah. bro, I'd rather you tell me, do this better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I'd rather you tell me, sh- I like, swear at me. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So it makes me better. Yeah, yeah. But that's me as well. Yeah, yeah. Like that's my weakness when it comes to ball and sports yeah, yeah. and that. Yeah, yeah. Because I expect more from everyone else yeah, yeah. that I would expect for myself. Yeah, yeah. But not everyone would take the same criticism, um, sim- similarly. Yeah, yeah. Like some some man them you have to tell them, oh, do better mm. this time. But I know the man them that I have to tell, I have to talk to you like that. Yeah, yeah. Do you get it? some man them you have to, bro, do it better. Yeah, I know you're better than this, bro. You have come. to, you have to talk more. Yeah, you have to talk more but aggressive. In mm. in terms of getting out, getting out the rut, I will say a new way that I found that just randomly happens is um you, the YouTube algorithm, man. Sometimes it just drops some gems in there, bro. Mm. <laughs> like mm. um, people like, for example, Kevin Samuels, and um, there's this other guy called um, Hafiz or something like that. He's like a men's like coach kind of thing. They've just been popping up on my on my YouTube, and I just be watching a couple of videos. I'm like, you know what? It just gets me like motivated, but not not just motivated because motivate motivation is dangerous in it because motivation can fleet in it. Yeah, mm. you you can get a little motivation buzz and then all you start and then all of a sudden like two weeks down the line, you've lost it. But kind of like just getting like just giving me like um, a sense of direction in it, and it's always good to hear from older mm, like old, yeah, so yeah. these guys older black guys as well. So they're like it's always good to hear from them because they obviously they'll tell you they'll tell you the things that they've experienced. They've already been through it, in it so it yeah. kind of gives me like. Okay, cool. Like I'm going through this. Oh, I'm I'm feeling like this now, yeah. But I need to shake it off, get my shit together, and and get moving, bro. Because I can't afford, I can't afford to be wasting this time, bro. Like we're in the, I'm in the latter stages of my twenties now, bro. Mm. I can't mm. afford to be wasting time. Need to be head down, grinding, grinding, grinding. Because if I don't do it now, I'm gonna regret it when I'm when I'm. Duh, duh, duh. So I'm kind of like I'm watching their videos, then I'm self reflecting, then I'm 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 geeing myself up, and I'm like, you know, what? I need to do this. I need to do this. And I think Shannon Sharp said something. He was like, um, he's like, doing something when you're happy or when you want to do it is easy. But the, the best, like the, the show of a man, yeah, and the best time when to do it is when you don't want to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, for example, when you don't want to, when, you know, when, like these, these men have been telling me, like, obviously you man have been saying, but also like Kevin Samuels and the man have been saying, like, as a man in, in your 20s and like, as when you're young, you should be, the, the way things should be set out, you should be working as much as possible. You should be, fit as possible mm. setting yourself up for you know how you're going to be in future so that you know you're not a freaking decrepit old man later you know all these things and obviously for obviously for um it helps with obviously like women and stuff as well mm. and he's talking about all this stuff and then you know it just i'm just like thinking to myself like yeah okay this this makes sense you know duh, 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 and it just i don't know it just gets the ball rolling and, I, and i'm thinking and i'm reflecting on myself and i'm thinking yeah yeah you know what this makes sense yeah i need to do this I don't want to do it today, but I'm going to do it because I just need to do it. You know, I don't know. Just do, do you know a problem that I have? Yeah. Yeah. So a problem that I have is that I feel like I put too much pressure on myself. Right. So like, it's good. 
that's a good thing. Uh, it is a good no, thing. No, no, but it's a good thing. And yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. It's but, good to an extent. I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good to explain. But as in, for example, right, like, I was, I was do stuff like I actually, I actually deeped it yesterday. Yeah, when I looked at my schedule for things I was doing on a Tuesday, on a Tuesday. Yeah, and obviously because Jonathan ain't got whip, I had to help him do best shit. So I was doing mm. Uber for Johnny, helping my sister do stuff, doing editing, going to work, all this kind of stuff. Yeah, mm. and I think to myself, and there's, there's, there's days where I'm like, bro, like you need to be doing more because there's a lot of 27 year olds out there that are doing I, I, it's that's not necessarily better than you that's the it's more like it's it's more like they're doing more than you that's the worst that, that's the worst thing you could ever do compare yeah. yourself to someone else I, I, I get that but you run, run your own race I, 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 I get that but, like, but no 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 but Mike's, Mike's right though because so, like at the same time seeing what your mates are doing and what, what like, in Africa they say look at your mates mm. but like seeing what your people your age are doing or even younger are doing it's again, it's, it's a good motivator. Like, if you're a competitive Thank person, you. it's a motivation. If you're, if you're a competitive person, like, if everyone, if every, if you're doing better than everyone, then you just rest on your laurels. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You'd be like, you know what? I, I'm, I'm already doing better than everyone. I can just chill. Because, because whereas if you're bro, seeing everyone doing better, you're like, is. you know what? I need to, I need to step my game up, man. I need to do my team. It has to be a motivation thing for you. Yeah. Do you get, bro? You can never compare yourself to someone else. Mm. It's, bro. It's your path. It's your path, bro. Mm. I see men that are doing better than me at my age. But I'm seeing it as a motivation thing. Yeah, yeah. He's got this whip. Next year, I'm gonna get that whip. Yeah, yeah. Do you get? Or oh, even something even better. I'm not looking at him like I'm hating on him. I, yeah, I, it's never I, that. I, like, it's never that. We could even use your house as an example, Mike. Yeah, bro. You just bought a house. Just, that's yeah. motivating me bro, to get my house. You yeah. just bought a yard, bro. I know, but that, that's do you the know thing. how many? Do you know how many people that, that bro, they've been they'll die. Yeah. yeah. Just for a yard, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And even even think about it now, yeah. During this period, this is pop, this is one of the hardest periods to get for a, young, for a young person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That especially not in a couple, you're you're single. Yeah, yeah. So it's the one of the hardest periods for a young person to get to a yard. Get a and, yard you, and you secure yeah, yeah. the yard. And you secure, yeah. bro. So it's a big it's a big Don't, deal, man. It's a big deal. Right I'm, now, bro. Myself, Kudzi's motivated. We're yeah, all motivated, yeah, 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 bro. Yeah. yeah. And that, that, that's the thing. I always I, like I always try to like remind myself that like because I'm like oh cool I got a yard but. I got, I got to get another one. No, like in my head. No, no, it's a good thing. Like, it's a good thing. Like, You're looking at other things. Yeah. Rem remember, I'm talking about this guy again, but man, like Kevin, but this is why I've been watching him recently because boy, it just puts into perspective, like as a man, like where it gives you like almost like a timeline of where he should be. Mm. Bruv, a t man doesn't hit his financial prime until his 40s. Mm. Mm. That's the reality, bro. So like every, everyone, like, I've, we've spoken about this before but like because of social media we're seeing all these influencers That's the and we're seeing all these like creatives and athletes and they're hitting their financial prime at 19, 20 because the money that they're making is just fast, fast, fast money mm. and it's, you know, it's it's not the norm, innit? We're working in normal-ish jobs. Mm. You know, we do this podcast as well and one day, God willing, it will blow in Jesus' name. Amen. Inshallah. All of that. But like, you know, it's our, our main job is 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 more of a a, a normal job. Mm -hmm. You know, we're trying to do things on the side as well. So that's why they say you got you got to work 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 set up now, so that when you set these things up as you're as you're young, as you get older, they will start to accrue the value that that, that you want. Obviously, it may it may not still reach the levels of a of a footballer, mm -hmm. but it's going to be a tangible. Tangible. I mean, I'm sure we're here. We're all aiming for like six figure salary at some point, or six figure Hundreds. earnings. Mm. <clears throat> that's 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 probably the goal. I'm but telling... on average, as a man, you're not going to reach that. Un not not only is that rare for a man, it's it's difficult to obtain. But as a man, you're generally not going to reach your financial prime. Whether it's whether you your financial prime is sixty k or your financial prime is hundred k, you're not going to reach it till you're like your your late thirties and forties. Mm -hmm. So there's like there's. I know there's a, there's like a feeling like raw like why am I not there now yeah but bro there, there really isn't a rush for mm. me for me I believe in timing man mm. bro everyone has their time mm. Mm. maybe it's it's the boys you're seeing it's their time not yeah, yeah, yeah bro your time is coming for, that's what I believe I believe in time from mm. patience I'm bro I'm the most impatient Donny you can ever meet mm. if I want something now I'm getting it mm. you get but I've learned that bro if you don't have that whip now there's a reason why. Mm. If you don't have this now, there's a reason why. Why a man man has it and you don't. I believe in timing, fam. Yo, my, my time's coming. I know my time's coming. Mm. Bro, God knows my time's coming. Just be patient, fam. Don't even don't look at everyone. Mm. That's the that's the problem about um society and fucking 
um, social media. Because mm. we keep looking at, oh, this Donny, he's only 22, you know, he's got this whip. Mm. Oh, this Donny's only 19, he's got this whip. You don't know what he's there. Mm. Bro, your time's coming, and a, man. And another factor that, 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 Im- that has an impact on that is obviously, yeah, mm. you're thinking, oh, I need to do these things so I can, <sighs> so I can, I can get this, I can secure this type of girl. At the same time, um, you may, they always say you, you're better off just fo- putting your head down, mm. focusing on your thing. And at the end of the day, if, if you're a tangible man, woman will gravitate towards what you. What do girls come anyway. with? What do you mean? Like, what are chess girls? Success. What chess girls? Yeah. Success. Yeah. yeah. So, if you keep chasing girls, mm. yeah. Not that any of us are, ch- are out here chasing, chasing. girls like that. Yeah. But if you keep chasing girls, that's all you're going to know. Mm. If girl, if you have, if you're successful in yourself, yeah, yeah, yeah. they come to you. You're mm. not chasing. Mm. Mm. No, good point. Good point. I got, I got one more like quick question to ask, right? And it's on the basis of like depression on that that basis, right? So like today, right? Like, have you ever had that feeling when you're driving, yeah, a car, and you say to yourself, if I was to just do this right now, I could crash and die, right? See when I, you have when you have little thoughts, bro. You it's it's not someone. it's not it's not saying I'm going to. No, do no, yeah, it. yeah I, I know what you're talking it's about. It's just saying like, oh, like let's just say if I was to slip up here, yeah, or if I, I if I if I went here, I could crash and die, right? So like today, God yeah, forbid. like like because I was really I was really quite down, yeah. Like today, like the question was, the question I had in my head was, like if I was to die, yeah, like. Do you, know what, do you know when people like commit, commit, commit suicide, right? Mm. In their head is people's lives would be much better if I wasn't in it. That's what a lot of people have when they're depressed, right? So that idea went, if I was to die today, the first thing that came to my head is my head had the, like a defense mechanism straight away. And I went, if you were to die, bare people would be bare upset. People's lives would be worse if you died. So straight away, before that thought went into my head, my head had a defense mechanism that said no. Like that's not happening, yeah. And I went, yeah, cool. That's that's done. That feeling's done with. And I had a, I had a thought in my head, like, well, okay, I have that safety the safety mechanism in my head, but other people do not. Other people have the thing in their head that keeps taking that idea deeper and deeper and deeper into their thoughts. That goes, yes, you. Ha- this is what will happen if you were to die. People will be happier. And then, I, and then I also had the idea in my head, like that mechanism in my, in my head that stopped me was like was like a survival instinct right because deep down right humans make basic instinct is to survive yeah. like if you go from like caveman days yeah like humans will survive anything at any cost anything. possible right so for a human to want to take their oh, own yeah. life that must mean their survival instinct is not working that is an illness in itself that your basic instincts are not working that you've gone i don't want to survive anymore i want to end my survival so I'm just thinking, is that what goes through people's head? Because I'm just because I can't, I I obviously can't understand, can't understand other people's head. So I try to use those thoughts that came to my head. Like, is this what sends people over the edge? Is this what sends people wayward? Well, there's other factors that would that will do that will push a person to that to that level. But for me, I just think, bro, I always think, man, life is such a gift, man. Like, pe- pe- yeah, people, 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 only got to take life, man. Yeah, for real. People that are getting older. They're just pray, they're praying for more and more years. They're looking mm. at you as a young person. They're like, "What I, I wish I was, what I wish I was you yeah. right now." So how can I ever take away this this gift? Like it's 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 just too valuable. It's too precious. Like I can't I can't fathom ever taking my like people die every day from so many different things, mm. and then for me just to come and rather than be take God forbid be taken out by something that's out of my control. I with my own hands take my own life. Mm. Does it, it, it? It's just no, not. Some, it's not like something I, I, me personally, I can do. But I get what mm. you're saying, Matt, because I feel like that Certain the person, person has to be pushed. It, they'll be pushed to that to, to that limit. point mm. where they think, you know what? I'm actually a burden to to people, which is which more time is never the case. Mm. And, it's like it's like um and yeah, they just they just top themselves, man, which is sad. Like when it comes to the to the famous people who take their life, yeah, mm. I feel like. Because they know that there's not everyone around them loves them. Mm. You get? They're just there because they're famous mm. and have money. I feel like when it comes to them, they take the drugs. The depression deep. The depression is deeper for them. Mm. If you know what I mean. Like a famous Tony, 
they'll know that the person that's with them today might not be with them when they when they're ill or not. Yeah, yeah. So they're only with them because they got money. Yeah. And they're providing. So, bro, it depends on your mental and your how strong you are mentally. Yeah. yeah. For me, bro, I can go through anything. Mm. Yeah. I'll not think about taking my life. Mm. That's God given fam. Mm. I'm only on this earth for what for, for once. Mm. Why would I take my life? Mm. Bro, it would affect everyone around me. Everyone around me. That's what I feel. I'm more selfish than that, bruv. I'm not even thinking about it. I'm thinking about myself. Mm. Why would I, I want to... Why, about why would I... Like, yeah, I'm going through... I'm, maybe I'm going through a bad patch currently. But there's been so many... Good, good, like, even people forget waking up, walking around. That's that's, a that's That's a positive. We take it for granted. But, bruv, do you know how many people that wish they could walk around? Mm. Or... For example, us us man that are living in the UK and that, bruv, we've got all this technology, we've got cars, we've got whips, we've got clothes, we got TV. Like every day is a blessing, really. Mm. How can I how can take I take my life, my own life here? Meanwhile, there's a Donny in a, a, a third world country that is that, that there's, there, there's, there's no water. there's no water. There's, there's no water. water. There's and no man's, water man, man's still fighting to survive. But me, I've got water on tap. I'm, I got everything here. If I want to order, if I want to order water from Amazon, I can order ten gallons, mm. and it will be here tomorrow. And then I want to take my life. I just can't. It's just, I don't know. It just seems, I seems selfish. It seems no. I, I That's don't know. why I, it's I, just I, not, like, I can't I, understand I used it. To no. think, I used to think that um, when it comes to fame, I used to think, bro, you got everything. Mm. Why would you take away? Why would you take your life away? You got everything. You got the house, the cars, the girls. You got everything. Why would you take that away? But then when you deep it, not everyone around them is real. There's so many fake people around them. Mm. They're just there because they're famous and they've got money. And they say the world is not enough. Some, well, so a lot of times it's momentary lows as well, which is why you, you got that. Like, this is probably why they say you need to talk to people. Them lows there, they're not going to last forever. Like, Mike, you've had a low today, mm. but you're going to bounce back. I it's, bounced back already. You bounce back already. It's calm. Bounce like, back it's, ability. It's, it's, a tempor- it's a temporary low, but like some people... Like maybe they're in those lows and they ain't got no one to bring them out of it or, you know, something like that. But it always gets better, man. Yeah. It always gets better. Respect that. Respect that. All right, let me go to something a bit more happier. <laughs> a bit more... Nah, sometimes you talk about these things, man. Nah, you got to let it out, man. Because you're not the only one that's going through it. Nah, I just I just thought I had to speak about it because I was just like, this is pissing me off today. <laughs> I was like, I need to speak about it. You know what's you know, you know, that tweet where it's like, guys use podcasts instead of going to therapy. Yeah, that's true. That's it. <laughs> to, or, 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 what did that girl say again? She said that you just, you're just, you got problems or something. Like. Yeah, because we, we use podcasts to, so our boys can co-sign our wayward behavior. And I was like, yeah, that's true. That was funny. Still. <laughs> I do way, wayward behavior. I haven't acted wayward in ages, which is which is bad <laughs> in my head, in my opinion. But <laughs> <coughs> we move, we move. 